Greetings, fellow nerds. We used dysprosium nitrate some time ago to make glow-in-the-dark powder. Now most dysprosium solids have the interesting property that they are slightly magnetic. They don't retain any magnetism afterward like a ferromagnetic substance, so this would be classified as paramagnetic. It's not very impressive, but strong enough to be attracted toward a magnet. Dysprosium is thus used for making various magnetic materials such as those found in motors, actuators, and hard drives. I think this is interesting because it's a clear crystalline substance that's magnetic, very different from the dark, opaque ferrites and metals that we're normally familiar with. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment.